with my lapis. Now I have to give you a little background on this. Jay did a lapis piece earlier today and everybody, everybody just kind of lost it. It was super popular. So guess what? We have a lapis and this, again, this is brand new. First time you're seeing it, a genuine high, high quality lapis necklace coming up in this show. And the best part about it is it's on sale. So you're saving a $22 on this one if you pick it up tonight in the show. Yes, we've got lapis back and we have the matching earrings to go with it. We'll talk about the little studs later. Check out this next item too. This is such a nice hour. This is the first time we've ever had it on sale. Lowest price we've ever done. And look at the length on this. It goes forever. I'm going to guess that's about 36 inches from my... Is it 64? No, it could be. Oh, it's 60 inch. Oh, better yet. Okay, here we go. Yep, it's 60 inches. Yeah, 30 doubled up, I guess. Anyway, it's beautiful. It's amethyst. And then we also have pink morganite, yellow meadowstone, and blue aquamarine. And this is one of the most versatile necklaces you'll see all night. Because you know you can wear it multiple ways. You can lariat it. You can knot it if you want to. You can triple it up. You just have a lot of necklace to work with. And we love that. And of course, you're going to have your little uh, hook on there too. So you can do all that fancy stuff with it. Yep, we got it right there. All right, so if you're just channel surfing, what's the show all about? It's all about Jay King. And Jay literally will go up and down and through and under and dig his way in. He will even pilot his own plane, because yes, he is a pilot, to get to some of the most unique and unusual gemstones in the world. He, he really does. He goes to the craziest nutty places. And we're all the beneficiaries of it because not only do we love Jay, but you know, quite frankly, we just love exotic gemstones and that that's what you should always, always expect when you're tuning in for one of his shows. So we're going to head into this next hour. Now, I'm going to show you one more time before we hit midnight, because this is a big, big deal. We started off the day with a very, very popular today's special, very long 32 inch gemstone necklace. Here's what I have left. And I have not seen this stone in years from Jay, and from anybody for that matter. We have a handful of what it's called a sodalite. I love sodalite, and the reason I love sodalite is because to me, I always call it my denim-friendly gemstone. But again, it has been on for a gazillion years, right? And look at this, chambray, indigo, mid-tone, it's all gonna work, right? So if you're a denim lover, you saw Diane a couple hours ago, then grab this. When we hit midnight, unfortunately, the price goes up. I have a couple hundred left and long, 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 and really big, fabulous beads. Oh, I didn't realize that. We actually have free shipping on this too, yay. But I wanted to show you that because the today's special starts at midnight and at the end of the day, it either sells out or we hit midnight and another today's special starts. And Adam's coming up with one in a bit. This is a this day only. Think of it as a mini today's special. So right now for less than one hour, you're gonna get this home for under $100. And check it out. It's probably the largest tiger's eye stones I have ever seen. And I'll tell you what, I love big bold jewelry because I'm not a little teeny weeny girl. So I like jewelry to be big and bold and this one's grand. Now we also have the matching earrings to go back to it. So Jay, I have never seen you do tiger's eye like this. You know, sometimes things like this just come to me. Okay. <laughs> it's fabulous. I love I, this I necklace. Just, I just, let me tell you, okay, I wish I could show you the drawing I did to, I was, I was, you know how like, I, you probably never did this, but I, you know, as a kid in school and stuff, I'd be drawing planes and cars and, you know, like. Oh, when I totally I'm doodled. To yeah, I'm supposed to be paying attention in class, right? right? So my mind tends to wander, right? Right. And um, so I was literally sitting in a meeting. I'm in a meeting and I'm supposed to be paying attention, right? <laughs> What the meeting was about, I have really have no clue, to tell you the truth. But it, it was boring me to tears, whatever it was. I, it was some business meeting that I was in. I was literally in a business meeting. I should have been paying attention. But that's how I am. I'm very juvenile. You know, I really am. <laughs> um, so I'm sitting there and doodling, and I'm drawing those shapes. And, and then at the end of the meeting, I walked out and I thought, you know, that looks pretty cool. You know, I'm going to do that. And so I gave it to one of my lapiders. Next time I saw, I saw the cutters. And I thought, okay, I wonder what I'm going to do this. And we just happened to have this beautiful tiger's eye that, that had just got in from Namibia. And um, it had, you know, some nice pieces there. There was like, usually they're real flat and real fat. But it had these pieces in there. I said, do it out of that. 
And so they took, they cut that, and we, we're brought, we're bringing it. I think it's a cool look. Okay, like it's it's like exotic. It's like contemporary ethnic. Yeah, look. it's so cool. I mean, it's big, it's bold. You, it has a two and three quarter inch extender. So if you want to wear it a little bit lower, you want to wear it a little bit higher. But as far as burning up the material, this is probably <laughs> one of the one of the most in, uh, in material intensive tiger's eye necklaces I've ever made. But I hope you love this because if you love, love this. I'm going to be doing all kinds of things. I, I'm going to do this in amethyst. I'm going to do it in all kinds of, of different weird um, exotic stones, actually exotic materials. If this if this really does well and people like the idea and they like the theory, then I'm going to expand on that theory. Now you can see I graduated as you go as it yeah. goes up, and I did that for a reason. I did it for comfort, right? Because if you if you you know if you try to make it all the big pieces all the way around, but do you notice how it graduates? It graduates down, yeah. but they're all free form. No two of these will be identical. It's so they're cool. all literally all just hand cut. They take the rough material, they just hand shape it. They uh, you know the pieces. They take it and they try to get the best. Um, chatoyancy mm -hmm. effect of it. You can see the chatoyancy in the earrings. You can see it in the beads. If you get this, it uh, the chatoyancy is Mother Nature's bling. So I didn't facet this. I just did a really super high polish on it. And oh my gosh, you see it like that, like that right there. It, it almost like you turned on a light bulb. Oh, it's, it, it, uh, it, Jay, fading. I'm over the moon on this one. And you guys are too. I knew you would be because again, it's chunky, it's big, it's bold. It's got that gold. There's so much gold in the tiger's eye. Like when you see it and it's so cool that you, I love, Jay, that you challenged your lapidary folks to carve a tiger's eye and not lose the effect. Because normally right. we all know uh, when you do tiger's eye, the best effect is going to be just a simple cabochon, just smooth oval cabochon, really. But they were able to pull this darn thing off. That's what's so neat about it. Well, you know, it's because of how they orientated. Uh, the, if you notice where, how the banding, the fire lines are yeah. laying on this, yeah, yeah, yeah. you see how they, that they actually oriented the stone when they did it. it it's really <laughs> it's, quite a cool you actually picked up on that. It's I'm a little, bit like, well, thank I you. I'm totally impressed. But look at yeah. that. I mean, it's crazy it's cool, you guys. It, and you, do you see how the, the fire line is is running yes, um, right. uh, vertical up it and down? It runs this way. Yeah, that, right. Right. You see that? How, how that, that, that and so they cut... They cut it with the fire line, so the fire line is is banding around the Wait, big Wait, there it nuts. is right there, you guys. Look at that. Look how yeah. crazy okay, nuts that is. That's the fire is. line. You see that? <laughs> okay, and they did that on purpose. Of Isn't course, that but it's such Isn't a challenge. I'm sure they looked at you like you had lost your marbles on no, this no, one. No, they actually have to take the material, they orient it. They, that's called the fire line. They right. look at where the fire line is and they cut around the fire line and they lay that out so you're getting the fire line exposed and so you get that. Point but that but, you, but you know what, Jay, is so cool. Then you said, oh, make it kind of this cool, weird pebble design. Like there is consistency in the shape that's, in a that's way. Because, that's how my drawing look. I should bring <laughs> I, I should have copyrighted this. I'm you telling should, you right totally, now. Totally, totally, yes. And just to give you an idea, we're going to go to Arlene in one second. I want you to see the earrings. Again, this this should hopefully bring home how really incredible the savings is tonight on something that's absolutely brand new. The earrings are beautiful, and that's what I say. There's your cabochon. That's the traditional way of pretty much cutting uh, tiger's eye, right? Okay, these are fifty. These these are fifty nine dollars. And 98 cents on sale as of this day only. And I want you to see this bottom stone, how big it is. And then I'm going to go to the very, the smallest of stones on here are still extremely large for a necklace. And this is only, what are we doing? 99, 98. Okay, if these are almost 60. Actually, their full price is almost $70. The necklace tonight is under 100. So just to show you, if we can widen out just a little bit. I mean, you can't even hardly see the earrings from there. You certainly can see the necklace. Just gives you an idea of really how great the necklace value is when you compare it to the price on the earrings. It's, it's truly incredible. Well, Miss Arlene in Texas, thank you for waiting. You're now on with the fabulous Jay King. Well, hello, Suzanne and Jay. Hi. How are you doing, Arlene? I'm doing fine. I wanted to comment about the reversible necklace that you had on a few minutes oh, sure. ago. Yep. I have that, and I absolutely love it. In person, it is a sparkler. 
It's a great, <laughs> which way do you wear it most often? I have worn it both ways and uh, the other side, Suzanne, with a white blouse with the collar up, it looks fabulous. Ooh, I love it. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, that and I cool. also have your other tiger eye, net, the beads, the round beads that are uh, that graduated. That have, that I have that, have that have one all, also. All, all colors, yeah. That have the red, the blue, and the golden tiger's eye. Oh, the it, one it is beautiful. It is so oh. beautiful. Anyway, I just wanted to comment, especially on the reversible one. Mm -hmm. Well, cool, and I appreciate that. And, yeah. And yeah, I can tell you that I have watched you all this day. Oh. It is so hot here, I had to stay inside. <laughs> and so I've watched you all day. <laughs> well, that sounds like a good idea on a really smoking hot day, Arlene. <laughs> <laughs> it's been wonderful. Well, so thank good you. to talk to both of you. Well, thank you well, for thank your time. You. Yeah, thanks for taking the time. I yeah, appreciate awesome. it. Yeah, that's awesome. Bye, really Arlene. Good. Yeah, and if you still want the reversible, we still have it available. Lowest price we've ever done. Listen to Arlene. If you don't believe us, listen to her. She's totally right about that. All right, guys, let me give you a quick update. This is our this day only, and this is important to understand the concept, especially if you're looking at this and you're saying, oh, yeah, that's me. It's got me written all over it, right? So if you're saying that, understand the price ends at the end of this hour. It will go up to its full original price. If you're looking for truly a stunning showstopper. This is your necklace. I love the fact that it's bold and it's big and it's unusual, but it has this amazing golden glow because of the tiger eye effect. So when you see this and when you wear it, especially when you're in various lighting conditions, all of a sudden that tiger's eye glow, that golden, it almost looks like gold dust, like tons and tons of little gold dust in there really sparkles and comes to life. You can see when it hits a light, when you move, when you walk, when you're under the sunlight, it takes on just such a different personality. And I love the fact that Jay is so unique and has created this very, very unusual design. Like he's never ever done anything quite like this. And you know, Tiger's Eye is a more common stone. We do see it in places, but trust me, you know darn well, you've never seen a necklace like this. And I'll tell you what the other problem with this is, even if you went to a mall and could go to a mall or whatever, and you went to the store, you know what they would do? It would be like a fake wood piece and you'd still spend $100 on it or maybe $87 on it. And it's like fake wood or some kind of plasticky thing. These are all hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of carats of tiger's eye and it's genuine and jay i can't imagine the size stone you had to start with to end with this really big necklace well if you look at it okay at any time that um you know that one of the the reasons i did this you you always have, anything that you cut you have to start with something that's bigger than that right to do it so these were large pieces. The, as far as carat weight, overall carat weight, um, I would say this is probably, if not the largest carat weight uh, tiger's eye necklace we've ever done, or it's darn, darn close to it, okay? <laughs> I mean, if it's not the top, it's right up there with the top two I or totally three. I totally agree. I completely <laughs> agree. You guys, and this is one of those, like, these are just yummy. It's just flat out yummy. By the way, it's 18 inches. You have a two and three quarter inch extender. Take that into consideration though, because these are very, very large stones. It's a fun, fun piece. And what I love, Jay, is if you're wearing light taupe colors from Marla, if you love wearing your chambrays from Diane, you know, if you love those lighter tones, it's amazing how it looks with light colors. But then as we transition to all those yummy fall colors and the heavier sweaters and the heavier materials, it's going to look equally as magnificent. I mean, I love Arlene said, she you know, wore that one reversible with a white blouse. This with a white summer blouse, it's very light and this big, chunky, fabulous piece. You're just going to love it. And honestly, I can't wait to get it at home. And does it work with color? Heck yes, all your denims, great. Any of your navies, any of beautiful, I love wearing pinks with brown. I especially love chambrays, contrast back to browns. Think of anything you'd wear with your gold jewelry, you could actually pull off wearing this with that because of the golden tones of the tiger's eye. And Jay, I'm sorry, but I forgot, where did you find this tiger's eye? Because you found okay, a lot of it. Okay, well, all the tiger's eye that you see from me all comes out of Namibia. Namibia okay. I have I have yep. one source in Namibia that, that goes out and mines it for us, and they uh, 
there there are sources they always provide the ultimate you know i have seen tiger's eye in a few other places around planet earth but the namibian material is far superior to anything i've ever seen el elsewhere in the world oh wow that's great you do so find it in, even in australia i found it in australia but not even close to this quality. Yeah, it's so spectacular. <coughs> okay, so we're gonna wrap up on this one again. Remember, time is of the essence. We only have 45 minutes and then the price is gonna go up. So I love it, because a lot of you like to see what Jay's got coming up, but at least write the item number down <laughs> because you don't wanna miss out on it. And I think we've sold 800 so far, so stay right there if you're on the line for it. Okay, we're gonna wrap up on that. Don't forget, we have the matching earrings. I do wanna mention our HSN card one more time, and here's why. Most of the time when you see us and we talk about the card, it's $10 or it's $20. It's very rarely $40 off. And what that means is you apply for our card. If you're approved, the first thing you buy with it, we're going to take $40 off. It's our way of saying welcome and thank you. What's really great is all the stuff you get once you have it. But my gosh, 40 bucks off right out the gate. That's spectacular. And we don't do it very often. Now, the problem is that ends on Sunday night. So if you've never gotten our card before, do it tonight. You take $40 off the J. King jewelry, which is pretty awesome. All right, we've got more to come. I do want to mention this really quickly. This is a little bit of a different tiger's eye. This is tiger and hawk's eye. It's a bead stretch uh, bracelet. It is a customer pick. The original price was $82.75. We're at $49.98, so that officially makes it the lowest price we have now offered ever on this awesome bracelet. It's chunky, it's big, I've been wearing it. Super comfortable though too. And again, totally stretchy, stretchy. Do I have time to ask Jay a question on it or no? Okay, Jay, can you give us like about 30 seconds? On the uh, bracelet, Jay? Yeah, this is the bracelet that we go back. And you, you know, Arlene was telling you about that turquoise or the uh, tiger's eye necklace that she bought that she was so happy with that was graduated round beads that had, it has the red, the blue and the golden material. This is the exact same rough material. This goes back to that perfectly. It's a great standalone bracelet, unbelievable value. You get all three of those colors, but this would go back to that necklace. It was actually made to go back to that necklace. Yeah, and it's a great standalone and also work back to the necklace that we just featured at us this day only. Absolutely. And so it looks, it looks fabulous. Okay. Yeah, because it picks up the exact color of this back in one of these beads. Okay, so we're gonna wrap up on that, guys. Now, when we come back, you ready? We have some lapis, yay! We have Azure Peaks coming up, so, and we have a lot of brand new, and wait till you see the additional sale prices just around the corner. With the power of HP from HSN, reinvent how you work, how you play, how you live. Technology that makes life better for everyone, everywhere, and deals designed for every budget. HP on HSN and at hsn.com. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. HSN. You're watching HSN. I'm Suzanne Runyon and Jay King's here. And because it's our birthday, we've had a series of trivia questions. If you missed last one, uh, Jay got it wrong, but we'll hope who does better this time. <laughs> and it happened to be about me and he got it wrong, but that's okay. He doesn't know everything about me. I have to have some surprises, <laughs> right, Jay? All right, here we go, Jay. Are you ready? Okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. Which of the following movies has HSN not partnered with? Footloose, Crimson, I don't, I have no idea. Footloose, Crimson Peak, and The Hobbit. Okay. What do you I, think? I have no clue, I, uh, Crimson Peak. I'm gonna say The Hobbit. Crimson Peak. I got it right. Hobbit. <laughs> that was a pure, <laughs> yeah. that was purely okay. guessing. Okay, I'm gonna tell on myself, okay? Do you know the one that I thought 
for sure that they had partnered with was The Hobbit. <laughs> so, I mean, that was the one I was sure about. So, you know, I've got, you know, I, I, if you ask me like six of these today, I got one right. And that was a, a, a trivia question about how, you know, how HSN started, right? The first yeah. media was radio, right? Yes, right, right, so, right. But I've got like, the rest of them. I, um, so Adam, his, what did he dream about being? And what it was, <gasps> you, uh, I got a that wrestler. one wrong too. A I got wrestler. that one totally wrong. I, I got I get astronaut. I did I mean, astronaut you know, too. I, astronaut. I did astronaut because I'm like he's kind of a little fellow. Wrestling thought, I didn't Adam, think was I'm in his Adam kind ever. of his wheelhouse. Who thought that he was a wrestler? <laughs> <laughs> I totally I, thought I think the same thing. <laughs> I think it's rigged. I think it's rigged. <laughs> so you're one for like ten right now. <laughs> really All right, Jay. Yeah. You ready? We got to keep going, buddy. We got a lot to get to in the last 40 minutes while Jay's here. And then he's actually rejoining me tomorrow. And we have a blockbuster show tomorrow night. Azure Peaks, we're going to go back to Azure Peaks. This is a brand new piece you've never seen before. Once again, look at the crazy good pricing. The appraised value is $175. Tonight, we're at $109.98 and four flex pays. What do you think makes Azure Peaks so desirable and collectible, Jay? Well, you know, I like it. It's, um, you know, it, it's one of those minds that, uh, as far as I know, I, I can't claim an exclusive on it. I will tell you that we do buy the select material that does come out of it. Sometimes they get a lot of material. Sometimes they get no material. It, it comes out of um, a mine that's in the, it's just on the outskirts of the Gobi Desert in the very southern portion of Mongolia. Um, it's a big copper deposit. When we first, actually how we found this, when we first found it, uh, a geologist friend of ours, who actually works for these big uh, uh, metal companies. I'm not gonna say who they are, right? They're out looking for copper, they're looking for gold, they're looking for silver, platinum, palladium, that, you know, uh, you know nickel, tin, that, that kind of thing. That's what they specialize in. Uh, he is the one who turned us on to this because they found the turquoise. Mm. Now, here's the deal, and I've said this before, but for people that uh, are just tuning in that they've never heard, heard me t uh, tell this, Here's the, here's the gig, right? When you find turquoise, you have to have copper. That means there has to be copper there. Now, you could have the largest copper mine in the world. Absolutely, and I know of two. Lar the largest copper deposits in the world have zero turquoise. So here's the thing. You could have all the copper in the world and, and have uh, turquoise uh, or, and no turquoise but you cannot have fine turquoise and not have copper. So he found the turquoise, he told me, and it, now it's a huge copper uh, property in getting more and more of the turquoise. That's oh. the person that, that brokers for. Right, because everybody's fighting for it. You're breaking up just a little bit, Jay. So why you yeah, do that? Yeah, breaking up. Oh, there we go. Um, I don't I was gonna go through a couple swatches for you because again, I want you to put this into your wardrobe. You know, when you have a really stunning turquoise piece, it's amazing how it morphs to all your different outfits. You can go from a solid to a print with turquoise. If you have a print at home, maybe it's a top, it's got a lot of like beautiful blues in it and then you pop turquoise on, it's really pretty incredible. But I love it with just a soft, gorgeous suede. Then I want you to see, now look how interesting this is. Watch the background color and look what happens to the foreground color. All of a sudden the more green turquoise pops. And then I'm gonna move here to a, a denim. And look, look at that cool. Look what happens. All of a sudden those blues just take to the forefront, but the greens kind of have a great little contrast too. Now I'm gonna to go to just a, I love this. This is just a taupe color. Taupe is one of my personal favorite fashion colors because it morphs and works with everything. So look at how awesome, if you have a lot of, Mar Marla Wynn does a lot of canvas. She does a cloud color. She does a taupey color. She does a sand color. Um, and look at how awesome that turquoise just comes to life. It's almost like it's been plugged in and, and kind of electrified. Then I'm gonna move to a little bit of darker tone. Look how pretty this. Look how it picked up right there on that azure peak, kind of a brownish color. And then we go to, again, to a taupe and then I wanted to go a really much much lighter color so you can just appreciate how beautiful that azure peak turquoise is. I love the contrast of the big beads versus the small little beads and you can see it's this whole one story two story and as you look to the back gradually it gets a little bit smaller but they keep that same fabulous pattern and then if you've not seen it this is the extender and I'll go through that real quick. 
best hooked on the face of the earth. Your necklace is easy to put on and darn it, they stay on, which I love. I love the fact that he gives us all a little love. Isn't that cool? That's a sterling silver puffed heart and always his extenders are two and three quarters of an inch. So in this case, we start at 18, but you can really extend it to much, much longer. And then again, look at this is a black top. I have a high-low top from Diane Gilman. It's still available, but look how pretty that is just against gray black. You know, turquoise has a personality and a style and a mystique of its own, and it's lovely to wear. Like, I love wearing Jay's turquoise. Jay, I think we got you back. Um, and again, I started, started doing that. Um, you were breaking up kind of badly, but what, um, what, what is it about turquoise that everybody continues to have such a great fascination over? Um, you know, it, you know, it's funny that you asked me that because, uh, we, you know, when I grew up, not that I've really grew, grown up, but let's just say at age, <laughs> right? <laughs> I've gotten older. Um, uh, you know, like it used to be that it was just the Southwest, but, but then Europe, and now you find it worldwide. And I think it's, it's here to stay and it. People are collecting it. They, they see the value in turquoise. And, um, and I, I think that that's what it is, the love of it. And what I love is that um, we can bring you all the different turquoises from around the world. And it's not, even on every continent, that's how rare it is. That's amazing. You know, what's interesting is, too, at one point, I know it became and still is a commodity. There are people who weren't even yeah. in the turquoise business who are buying ton. They're buying it up, and they're not making anything out of it. They're buying it literally as a commodity, correct? They're buying it up. Uh, especially the high blues, mm -hmm. and they're they're not even in the jewelry business, which is so crazy. Right. And they're driving the prices up. The only reason that I can survive, uh, quite honestly, and I probably shouldn't be saying this in front of millions of people, right? <laughs> but <laughs> the, how we survive in this market is they don't go where we go. They don't have our sources. Be they would be on the doorstep competing with us if they knew about it. It had the they actually had the source. True. That, yeah, absolutely um, true. Uh, driving the prices sky high. Yeah. But they're not putting it in jewelry. They're buying it as a commodity and putting it away like you would buy silver or gold or, or whatever, you know, beads. You're buying it as a commodity. You're saving it up because they know it's rare and the value is there and it's a good investment. Yeah. And this is just such a good and piece. Do, do you want me to get Patricia? I'm going to get her on real quick. Patricia in California. Hi, you're on with Jay and Suzanne and welcome. Hi. Uh, hi, Suzanne. Hi, Jay. I love you, Jay. And I was calling about the um, the tiger eye. Yes. And I have just about, I have so many different pieces of your tiger eye. Can you hear me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we sure can. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have so many different pieces of your tiger eye, but what I wanted to ask you about is elongated, maybe like a three-inch long um, uh, earrings. You know, tiger eye earrings? and have it with the blue tiger eye and the gold tiger eye and the regular tiger eye like that. I have that one. So I okay. really love your jewelry. Okay, so do you want, you're, you're saying you want earrings that are, that are made out of that material that go long? Yes. <laughs> okay. Because you know you've been like, you start making the long gated ones, which I brought, uh, I think only three, because I brought three different ones. I had the animal one, that's elongated, and I have, uh, uh, I think it's the um, Am Amethyst. Hmm. Yeah, they're shoulder dusters. What? Where right. they they're call really them shoulder long, dusters. Yeah. That's it. Yes, the shoulder. Thank you. <laughs> yes, that's what okay. I'm talking about. I yeah, I can do that. She's, I can do that. She's placed um, her order. I'll Patricia put that has on. placed her order, Jay. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you, sweetie. We appreciate you calling in tonight. <laughs> They're getting in there and Jay, make me, got to make me that, okay? And I love that. The shoulder dusters are pretty darn fabulous. So, Patricia, I'm with you. I understand that, love. All right, we're going to wrap up on this. I do want to mention, if you missed our other Azure Peaks, and you'll see what's really different, and I really appreciate what Jay does. He keeps collections of stone colors together because this one looks wildly different than this guy, right? This we had earlier. Here we go. Less than 100 now remain. We have less than 100.
100 left. This started out at 164, appraised at 235, 119.98. It's wildly different my, than my other design. So I wanted to make sure I showed you both because obviously it's appealing to different styles. Uh, so again, stay on the line for this one if you'd like it. We do have this one available in case you missed out last hour. Now, coming up next, ooh, we're gonna get to lapis, which is great. And we have more on sale items still to come before we wrap this day up because coming up at midnight, we have a new day and a brand new Today special. Hello, Adam. Suzanne, we are excited tonight. Um, it, well, basically, we're looking at the birthday treatment. We're doing the birthday treatment, this time with HP, the number one computer brand in America today. I've done it again for HSN customers, an exclusive offer. Um, you're looking at everything. I mean, I don't even know where to start. It's 17 inches. It's a touch screen. It's the largest solid state drive that we've ever done. We're looking at 512 gigs. So it's lighter, it's faster, it's quieter. The most RAM we've ever done at eight gigs of RAM. Uh, we're going to include three years of premium technical support. That's valued at $120. We include the specialty mouse from HP. There's another $20. You could choose with or without Office. And as your mind starts to think about, gosh, dare I even say the new school year with all the options that are on the table there, whether it's distance learning, whether it's going to college, university, whatever it is, we need technology today more than ever. Not only do we need technology, we need jewelry. I can help you with the technology and Suzanne and Jay can help you with beautiful jewelry. Back to you. Thanks, Adam. So we'll see you in about 30. So stay with us and we'll launch a brand new today special. Now, also, what happens in 30 minutes, and this is East Coast time, our four flex on everything. That was a flash event that started at 7 p.m. and it ends right when you see Adam. We have four flex on everything right now that changes at midnight. So if you want to get something home, have four months to pay it off, but you get it right away, you want to get all your orders in before we hit midnight. And we're down to obviously the last 30 minutes of that special event. So Take advantage of the fun because it's an easy way to shop, especially for J. King pieces. All right, now we're going to talk about lapis, beautiful lapis. Lapis is one of the rarest stones and also one of the most coveted. And Jay has, has been talking about this for a long time. Lapis is now becoming like Haley's Comet when you watch a J. King show. We just don't see it very often and there's a very good reason why but tonight he saved and this is absolutely brand new you're getting the very first look at it it's on sale i have the matching earrings you're looking at top quality stunning blue lapis so we have it back and jay it is true i mean you've talked about this for quite a while really it's getting harder and harder all the time for you to find very very high quality lapis Okay, what you're seeing here is Jay's death throw. Wow. <laughs> last to the last, really. This is it. Okay, I, I can demonstrate this if you want. Okay, I'm gonna take a piece of my lapis rough, I'm gonna lay on the floor, and I'm gonna flop around like a dead fish, okay? Because <laughs> I'm gonna symbolize what is happening to the lapis. You oh, know what, wow. I kept stalling, um, trying to just hold on to my lapis rough, I'm not getting any for the last, well, last year I didn't get any at all. Mm. I just I just secured about a ton of really premium lapis. It was a fluke accident. I got it. Um, that'll make about five, uh, that one ton of lapis would make, of, of this would make 500 of these necklaces. That's wow. it. That's how much material it takes mm. that you have to start with to be able to yield this. Now, that being said, why am I doing this? I'm doing it because you know what? I've given up. <laughs> okay, I just you know <laughs> I no seriously I'm I'm being honest with you. I I, I know it's it's not that I'm giving up as a defeatist, but you know what? Um, I'm going to make it last as long as I can make it last, and then when it's over. It's over. That and that's the best I can do. This material is material that's been in my private collection. Some of this material could have been in there for up to 20 years. We're taking, what we're doing now is we're circling the wagons, taking all the warehouses, we're gathering all the material that I have left. Fortunately, all the material that I have left is dominantly this grade, this really high grade, this 
yeah. material. That's beautiful. Yeah, guys, and if we go in just a hair bit tighter, I want you guys to see that, only because it's, it is high grade. It is absolutely some of the best lapis you'll find in the world. It's stunning, really, really stunning. Look how vibrant blue that is. Um, now, I do have the matching earrings, and it is important. Um, you know, it's funny because Jay has talked about um, stones not being available. Rainbow calcilia is one of those. And it was probably, I don't know, Jay, you know, maybe three, four years ago, he kept saying, it's no more, it's no more, it's no more. And then it really wasn't anymore. Like nobody believed him for the longest time. It's like, you know, shouting you know fire people? in the in the theater, you know? And then it ended and then everybody erupted and said, where's your rainbow? Where's your rainbow stuff? And he's like, I'm telling you, I have no more of it. And it's sad you know, because- I, I go ahead. still have people asking me for rainbow calcilica. I know they and, do. You know, <laughs> it, you're, you're, it's just not gonna happen. The same thing with this lapis and, and here again, that's why I'm saying I'm giving up. So here's the deal. I'm gonna have these, I've got deals in uh, lapis in the line in necklaces until the end of the year. I'm, I'm, I'm finishing up right now. That's how far out that we have to design, right? Wow. Yeah, I have to design that far out. Um, this is material that I allocated six months ago. That's why you're seeing it now. So I allocated this rough material six months ago. So now I'm writing, there'll be, I know that there'll be lapis through the end of the year. Beginning of next year, I'll have a few pieces. After that, no telling. I mean, I right. to, to be honest, it, as far as being to do necklaces, uh, it might be all over. Right, you won't you won't anymore. Right. So and if you want, and you want this grade of lapis. This is something you maybe need to think about. Yeah, I wouldn't wait too much longer. In fact, he had one lapis piece on earlier and it was absolutely on fire. And I love this one too, because this is very feminine. I think it's very, very pretty. I love the beads start very small in the back and they graduate to quite large centimeter in the front. Uh, they go from, uh, they're three millimeter in the back or millimeter. And then they go up to a whopping 12 millimeter right when you get down here to the bottom. So again, these are significant pieces. They're not just little teeny seed beads. And you know what? When was the last time you even went to the mall or a store or a jewelry store and they had a full lapis necklace? I, I, you know, I think sometimes when you watch our shows a lot, if you do, or you're like a host here, you know, we're like, oh, it's lapis. That's great. And it is lapis beautiful. I think sometimes we get jaded and we forget that you just don't don't find it in traditional shopping. And I think that's what makes it so popular when Jay does it. But again, it's a matter of availability. Lapis is found in Afghanistan. It's very difficult for Jay to go to Afghanistan. In fact, he doesn't. And typically he works with, in, in fact, very rarely he works with middlemen, but in this case he has to. Now imagine with what's going on and how hard it is to find it and now add all these extra layers of difficulty. Thus, that's why it's just not available anymore. We love I love this too because of the length. I think it's so ladylike. I think it's beautiful. Again, I go back to my denim girls. For those of you who love your chambray and your indigos and all those denims, lapis looks great. But lapis, sodalite to me is beautiful. I don't consider sodalite, which is a part of our tape today's special. I'll show you this. This is sodalite. To me, sodalite is the perfect denim necklace, right? But for lapis, you can go to denim. But what I love about lapis, unlike sodalite, I think this is a little bit more casual, lapis can take you to that elegant evening out and we will have them please lord let's have them earlier than later i want an evening out sooner than later for sure but lapis can take you there because it's that elegant it's that rare it's just that beautiful to have in your collection we're busy we knew we we're going to be busy do not miss out on this it is brand new save for you and i tonight no one else has seen it and we do have the matching earrings to go back to it in that little stud design jay is back all right jay any more scoop on the lapis you should tell us Okay, well, here's the, the kind of the skinny on this. Like, um, I could have designed all kinds of crazy bead designs or gone really wild, but I'm at this point, what I'm trying to do to get everybody kind of prepared is I'm doing basics, things that I consider basics. Mm -hmm. And you kind of hit the nail on the head there. Um, this is something that everybody should have in their jewelry wardrobe, right? I, I think a well-appointed jewelry um, case should have at least a contemporary single strand of lapis, just like you should have a high blue turquoise, a green turquoise, something black, a string of pearls. Mm. Those are all basics, right? Those are things that you're always gonna use. For this, think about this. Okay, you could dress up with this. You could dress down with this. You could use this as a base piece for a layering piece. Mm -hmm. There's just so many things 
that this is a basic. This really, truly is a basic. It's like having, um, you know, like I'm a guy, so you and I can relate to it. You're like your toolbox, right? Your jewelry, if you think about this, your jewelry case is, a, a, for me, it would be my toolbox. Okay, well, there's certain things in my toolbox that you just have to have in your toolbox. It's just a tool that you have to have. It's a basic tool. This is a basic tool for your jewelry accessories. That is really totally what it agree. is. Yeah. And that's why I kept it simple. I'm telling you, though, and I, I'm quite honestly, okay, you cannot get this grade of material. This material could be over 20 years old. I have no idea. It's between three years and 20 years old. Huh. This is all my private stash that I put back and put back. And it was kind of like my rainy day. And I would use this material as I was getting new material that was coming in, right? But this is really, you know, I always, how I always say, I always say the, the best for the last. Mm -hmm. Well, now you're looking at it. You broke okay. down and, and said, all right, I'm going to use it. You know what, Jay, I want to go to Judy in Texas. It's going to last. Well, it lasts. I, I just want to, I want to jump to Judy in Texas because she's been very generous waiting. Judy, thank you so much. You're on with Jay King and Suzanne. Hi, guys. Hello. How are you doing? I'm great. Suzanne, I think you're hilarious, and I think you're a great host. Thank you. <laughs> Jay, I've been a customer of yours for... 24 years? Are you 24 or 25 years there? I'd, it'd be 25 this year. Okay, 25 years. Um, well, I, I love she, you. And you sent well, me to you. the poorhouse this weekend. <laughs> oh, no, I don't want to do that. <laughs> well, I, don't want to do that. I, bought, I bought the Soda Light and the Rosa Night. Mm, cool. That's today's special. And then... And then I purchased, it was a heart, green, moss, something or other. I can't remember the name of it. Yeah, a, a Namibian green goddess opal? Is that what it yes. was? Yes. And then I bought the, the uh, red jasper. Okay, Un unbelievable. My it was gorgeous. Gorgeous. And then I bought the um, boulder turquoise. Guy, oh, that sold been out shopping. last hour. Yeah, you have been busy, <laughs> Judy. So far, so far, you have made a wrong decision. Yes, I mean, right. every one of those and, key items. And then I bought the, um, um, I loved it, the tiger's eye necklace. Oh, that thing's gorgeous, Judy. Uh, oh, I love gorgeous? it, I love it. Well, Judy, I we can't stand it. <laughs> well, by the way, well, Judy, so, oh, go ahead, Jay, I'm sorry. It. No, I appreciate, I appreciate her patronage. And, and, you know, and it's people like you that have made it possible for me to still be here and still be doing this. So thank you so much. And Judy, not to make you totally crazy, but Jay and I are back tomorrow night and we still have a ton <laughs> of brand new items coming up. Hey. <laughs> and I wanna show Judy, thank you Judy too. This is what she got. If you guys missed it, this was my this day only for this hour. Can we repeat it just real quick? Um, Rocky, I know I'm going out of order here, but here's the scoop. The problem is the deal on the, and it's a, this is one of the best deals all night long, right? You have 17 minutes of take advantage of the pricing. It's a this day only, under $100. We're talking hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of carats of a genuine tiger's eye. This is genuine in just the coolest design, right? I've never seen Jay work in tiger's eye quite like this, and I love it. It's big, it's chunky, it's bold, but again, as of this day only, when you see Adam talking about that great HP computer coming up, this goes up, and I don't have a lot of these left, so that's what Judy actually added at the last second to her order list. Also, please don't forget the whole four flex pay thing on everything today. You want to get, I don't care if it's cookware or bedding or whatever it is. If you want to use that four flex pay, it was a surprise event. Started at seven, ends tonight in this hour. All right, check this out. We got, okay, here we go. This is cool. We have 15 minutes to go. Three items, all fresh brand new lowest price cuts. And we're talking really, really nice price cuts. So here we go, Iron Mountain, very famous turquoise, Iron Mountain turquoise. Originally, this is 134, we're under $90. I mean, look at how bold these beads are, I'll just show you. If that was a ring and I had just this one turquoise stone and it was made into a ring, that's a big ring, right? Now, take it all the way around the necklace. I love the shape and the smoothness of this as well. And Jay, the lowest price, we have not 
seen this since December of last year, actually. Well, and here's the deal with the Iron Mountain, the reason, you know, remember you used to see Iron Mountain, Iron Mountain all the time. You know, we had a lot of the material. Mm -hmm. This is another one of those turquoises that are going by the way. Oh, it's, um, you know, uh, we, we're really, you're looking at the, the kind of the last of the last of the last. Uh, literally, I don't have any of this rough material. This will be one of the last few designs that you'll ever see uh, from me. They cut this, they did a sale price on this, which is even mind boggling. Uh, what the, they're literally giving this away. This is an incredible price. But if you, if you collect the turquoise, this will be one of the turquoises that soon that it will be uh, in the past. You'll never get that. And you know what's really heartbreaking about it? There's actually more turquoise in this mine, but they won't let us mine it. They're, oh. They've just, there's no way to get to it. Okay. Um, Where's it, it for, located, they, uh, Jay? It's, it's, in a, it's in an iron mine. And the, well, where? the problem is it's in very, very, it's uh, really on, uh, northern, northern China, almost on the border of uh, Mongolia. Oh, no it's kidding. It's way up. Wow. Way up, actually, the northwest. It's on. It's on the other side of Mongolia. If you look on the map on the corner, it's way up there. It's a huge iron mine, which is really. It's unusual that you find turquoise in an iron mine. Right. It, that's not common. A copper mine is more common. Right. But when it rains, you can literally see the turquoise on the other side of the mine of of where they're mining of the thing. But they, they're after the iron, and they want nothing to do with the turquoise, and they want nothing to do with us. Oh, so wow. it's kind of one of those. <laughs> what that, a bummer, that, right? <laughs> yeah, no, it's a bummer in the fact that, you know, you see the potential, and you know it's there, right. and it's easy to get to, but they just don't, they're, they're not interested at all, and it's more of a hassle for them for you to go in there and mine it. So the, the, the way they solve that is they just don't let you mine it. Oh, wow. Hey, I do have to give an update on this. We have less than 300. Okay, we have a little over 200. I got an update. A little over 200, and then this is sold out. Lowest price we've ever offered. And I think the Iron Mountain is a very distinct turquoise. You can see it's got a really lot of cool hues, but they're all bright. This is a really light, bright turquoise. You know, it's got a lot of, of that beautiful robin's egg blue. You see it right there. Look at how it almost glows right there. And then you have a little bit of the browns, a little bit of the greens in there. Love that combination, but just really a pretty stone. All right, Gail in Massachusetts, you are now on with Jay King. Thank Thank you so much for waiting. You're on the air. Welcome. It's my pleasure to wait for both of you. <laughs> well, thank um, you. I, I have ordered so many items, Jay. I can't even tell you. I spent my vacation money on your jewelry because I couldn't go on vacation this year. <laughs> oh, there you go. I'm glad you did, but I'm, but I'm sorry you couldn't. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. Vacations will be in the future for all of us, I'm sure. It's That's just true. that we all need to be safe right now. But I so enjoy all of your jewelry because it's all natural. It's all, you know, so unique. And it's just not what you buy at the big box store. I love the creativity, the artistry. It's just all so appreciated by me. Oh. And thank you so oh. much for, for being with, with us on the air. And Happy to spend my vacation money. <laughs> well, I, I'm, I'm sorry that you didn't get to take your vacation. I'm, I'm in the same boat. I, I, you know, I'm not yes. traveling. Um, no. To the point, it's, it's really funny, is my wife, you know, one of the big things, you know, since we've been together is that I travel all the time. Um, so <laughs> that was always... Oops. And, and, okay, Suzanne knows my wife a lot, right? I do. She, she knows my wife. She's a okay. fireball. She is a fireball. But... <laughs> It's come to the point of relationship. She's waiting for the day that I can travel again. In fact, when I came over here, oh, I made dear. her so happy. Oh, dear. I tell you what, does it she, was like giving her go, a vacation. Does she not want to go with you on these adventures? Um, no. <laughs> okay. I, I won't ask any more questions. That's fine. No, I, 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 I think it was so, so no, interesting. She's not, up when it tracks out to the mines. No. Well, Gail, okay. thank you, sweet pea. If you met Sheila, Sheila is a girly girl. She's fabulous, but she's very stylish and she's very dressy. I could not see her. And Sheila, you know I love you. I could not see her <laughs> 
going to the places Jay goes. She'd be like, oh, no, thank you. <laughs> and she's English, too. I don't know if that matters, but anyway, sorry. Okay, the Iron Mountain is sold out. Great, here we go. We got two more items we're gonna get to, Jay, real fast. I just want you to see, these are brand new save for price cuts. Look at this fun necklace. This baby comes in at 60 inches long. I just stood up so you can see I've knotted it. Um, Kenya, oh, it looks fabulous. She's done a triple strand on this. It actually is the longest necklace in the show. And together you're getting amethyst, you're getting pink morganite, yellow metal, meadow stone, and blue aquamarine. So Jay, this is a nice long design. Yeah, you know, and you know, the meadow stone is actually gaspyite. And what I love with this, it's 60 inches. So what I really love is it's taller than Lynn. Okay, <laughs> you know, there's a trivia question. Okay, that would be a good uh, trivia for, question. It just that would be a great tri trivia question. <laughs> what what show host on HSN is shorter than is your 60 inch necklace? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wait here, I'll show you. I'm gonna go over here, guys. Um, Andre, I'm gonna go over here. You ready? Okay, here we go. So Lynn is Good. shorter than, they're gonna go really wide. Do I need to back up a little bit? Okay, here we go. Okay. So here it is. Fortunately, I'm taller than necklace, but Lynn is literally shorter than this. That's hilarious, Jay. But look at how much stone you get. Isn't that crazy? At five feet, think about that. Five feet, you got four yeah. materials here. You've got the amethyst, uh, you've got the gaspyite, you've got uh, morganite, and then you've got the aquamarine. So you've got four natural materials, all in 60 inches. And you know what everybody loves about these? Is they love the fact that you're making one buy and you get all these different looks that you can do with it. We played with this one time, we had a contest, and I, I think I came up with over 20 different designs that I was able to do with this. There were some people that cheated that actually got enhancers and stuff like that, you know, right. and cheated. But <laughs> uh, but I came up, I believe it was 20 or 22. I can't remember uh, different designs, different looks that, that you can do with these uh, these types of, of designs, these types of necklaces. Now, it all depends on how the beads are cut on the on the on the versatility of what you can do so you know uh but this one i this is the very first time that we've actually done these four materials together and it, again a fabulous price so if you think about this you're 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 buying one look one design but you're getting a multitude of looks multitude of ways that you can accessorize with it okay so i just did one you ready okay so kenya's wearing it a triple strand which you can because it's done look at this now see now, okay. And that was one of mine. Let's get a reference so point. Cool. What if you had to buy all these gemstones and buy one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight gemstone bracelets? How much money would you spend just buying one? You, like just if you put it on, you know, um, elastic, right? You get the look of eight of them in one necklace. That's great. Look how fabulous that looks too. Isn't that fun? Yeah, you know what, and it, you know, normally that would be what, about $49 would be a good price for a, that something that size yeah. stretch. So if you say like, so that would be almost a little less than $400 you would have to spend <laughs> to, to do get that all. same look. You're totally yeah. right. Yeah, and I do want to show you guys how I did it. That's that famous clasp on the back. It's sterling silver. It doesn't have an extender because obviously it's long, but that allows you to give you all this variety and that'll stay put. That's what's really neat. Now also notice too, what I did is I knotted mine really low, but if you wanted to, you could knot it very high. You could double it up around my blouse collar. If you wanted to drop it down the back with some gorgeous top, you could do that. Um, it, it really is, you buy it once, as you said, Jay, and again, there's a multitude. Oh, you know what we didn't show? I love a trossade. Let me show you this. This is one of my favorite things to do with these necklaces, is double it up or you just twist it and then you wear it like that, which I think really dresses a necklace up. Or if you really get creative, look, Jay, I'm going through all the ways you can wear it. You can go like this, and then you put it on like this. And then what I do is I do rubber bands in the back and it makes it a really cool necklace. So little tip, I hook rubber bands on both ends with a um, safety pin in the middle. I just revealed one of my jewelry hacks. That's a jewelry hack. All right, um, how many do we have left before we have to wrap it up? Lowest price ever. We've never done a better value. Uh, fewer than 300 left, so this one's almost sold out. My last one is sold out. Yeah, did we sell that one? Or it's darn close if it isn't. Okay, we got a couple more minutes to go. Here it is, the last item in the show, and it's gorgeous. And when you first see it, you go, is this jade? Because it looks a lot like very high-end jade, like very expensive, but it's actually a green quartzite. And we've not seen this since December, Christmas of last year. Jay, where in the world did you find this? Okay, this actually uh, is a mine find out of Brazil. Okay, wow. And 
this it looks as close to emerald as anything you could you can imagine. And I have to tell you, this is a natural quartzite. Usually, when you find quartzite, this is a material. It, it, this isn't a color that you think of in quartzite that it comes in. This is a beautiful, beautiful high green, an emerald green, a natural green, uh, and it comes out of um, this comes out of Brazil. Mm -hmm. I will tell you, I have a similar material that I'm working on right now, I'm really excited about, that looks like this, that'll pair back to this wonderfully, that comes out of Pakistan. It's a new material that's coming out of Pakistan. But there's a great shot of it right there. If you look at the earrings, this yeah. is like an emerald green. This is like, a na that's natural, okay? that It looks so clean that you would think that that's like some kind of enhancement or, you know, we've done something to the quartz material, the quartzite material, but we haven't. That's the natural color. of. Look how clean that is. Isn't that phenomenal? Oh, it's, it's, and it's really bright. It's a really bright green, actually. Yeah, it's beautiful. And then here again, these are all fancy cut hand fasted beads. That's pretty. Again, they're free form beads that we've hand fasted. There's no machine that'll cut these. These are all individually hand cut one at a time, right from the natural quartzite rough. Um, this is really truly an art, truly a skill, something very fun. We, you know, we did the stretch bracelet, we did the earrings and we did the necklace and we did that for a reason because um, uh, I guess if you had emerald or if you had maybe chrome diopsy, we'd go back to this. There's, there's a few things that go back to it, but um, to make sure that, that we had something that kind of matched uh, this green that would go back perfectly to it, we went ahead and did a whole ensemble, a whole uh, set, whole suite of these just and we only have the earrings and the necklace left um, on sale. First time, lowest price ever. We're kind of ending this show in a bang. Um, I just want to show you again some color swatches, how pretty the green is. Jay, um, I also thought it looked a bit like jade, actually, like really high eye and jade. Well, you know, like with jade and here again, um, uh, jade in that color is what they call, uh, would actually be gem, jade, gem grade, right? right. Um, you got jade in that color. Um, that necklace, um, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, it really, if that grade of jade, honestly, that necklace would probably be in the five to $10,000 range. Oh, if you could geez. get it that quality, it's not, but right. that's what it would be, right. honestly. Well, when you I know, saw it, really I was like, at first glance, I'm like, oh, man, yeah, that is like a really expensive jade. Where did he find that? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's I, awesome. I got to tell you. If I had jade in that quality and uh, that, I would, uh, I definitely wouldn't be cutting it up into beads. I would be <laughs> going, I know, I know a couple of guys, okay, <laughs> that, that, that would be more than willing <laughs> to be buying it from me. They would probably so, take that off your I, hands. I'd be looking at that four-wheel drive Lamborghini and making it, making my dream happen. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is exquisite, I'll tell you. So, hey, if you want to look like you're wearing the most expensive jade in the world, then I would also say you might want to invest in this. And those of you who love jade, I think it's great. Uh, but to your point, too, it's such a vivid green. It's so beautiful. If you guys can shoot, I don't know, against the black, only because I just want you to see, look at how bright green that is. And I love it, too, because you know darn well when you're wearing this, there's going to be people who say, oh, my goodness, where in the world? What is that? You say, oh, it's green quartzite. Tell them the story you know it's just so much fun to have jewelry that matches your personality you know if you like the right. unique and but unusual this, is, this certainly is it the only time that we've ever done this material right i mean i've never seen it i've been doing this for 44 years right. i've seen quartzite um not all my life but a good portion of my life i've, I've been turned on to quartzites from around the world you do find it in different locations this is the very first time that i've ever seen this green quartzite, this clean like this, that it's, it's, so it really is, it was a mind find when we brought it on. I've never seen it again. I've never seen it since then. So uh -huh. this is the one time that I actually got the material. I love it. All right, Jay, so I'm gonna say thank you for, for now. Um, I will be back with you tomorrow. We've got a couple more hours coming up. Lots saved for that show. So thank you for a great evening. Thank you so much. It's always fun working always. with you. And I, I'm excited about our show. I was looking at it before I came. We got some really cool stuff coming up. Okay, so we see that tomorrow night. Stay with us coming up next, a brand new day and a brand new Today Special. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person.
love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search gemstone to see our gemstone enhancement chart. Birthdays were made for shopping. Our birthday, your presence. It's our birthday. Happy birthday, HSN. Let's celebrate. So come join the fun. Well, good evening, everybody. Welcome on into HSN. It's time to take that birthday treatment and apply it to the wonderful world of electronics quite specifically HP, the number one name, the number one brand in the world today when it comes to laptops, computers, when it comes to technology that brings us together. Tonight, the biggest screen, the best offer, the lowest price, it has to be a today's